Hello, it's Jason Payne for Cold Banker Dan Harp Realtors. Well, I'm back out in New Braunfels, Texas in a brand new community called Greenfield. It's not spelled like the color, it's spelled like the name, the name of the town Green. And why is that? Well, because it's just a couple of minutes, just literally two minutes across the road here is the beautiful Green, Texas. I love that place for, that's where I did the grist mill uh, video. There's whiskey drinking, wine drinking, lots of live music, all the Band, lots of bands come through here. I mean, Green is one of my favorite places on earth to be. I love it, especially on just a regular night. The weekends it gets a little crowded. But anyways, behind me, we have a Bel Air home, and it is a beautiful home. Well, let's go check it out. Bel Air is a really nice builder. Um, these houses in this community are mid threes to mid fours, depends on what you're looking for. They do have, Bel Air does build some garden homes out here. And they also have some uh, family homes, which can get in the high fours, depends on what you're putting into it. But like I mentioned uh, before, the biggest selling point in this community is its proximity to the green, which is right next door. And these are good homes. And if you look around, they still have lots available. And as I'm filming this, it's mid April, 2021, finding home, finding communities that have lots available, it's getting really hard to do. All right, let's go check out the inside. All right, let's go check out the inside. Yes, it says it's closed, but uh, they opened it for me. Because, yeah. All right. Some nice tall ceilings in this home. Now, this would be the entrance to the garage. So, that means the utility room's probably right here. And it is. Got some shelves there. And right up front, we have the perfect guest room with their access to a bathroom. They do gotta come out the door, so it's not a complete private bathroom. But a good sized guest bedroom. Or kids bedroom, whatever you wanna do with it. Kind of neat. I like having the multiple entrances to the kitchen here. We do have the dark brown cabinets. Kind of show you a little slow motion view of the area. But a nice size island right in the middle. Here, you have a formal dining room slash breakfast nook area. This is a gas community, so uh, that's really important to a lot of folks. Now that doesn't have the giant island like some homes have, but this is very nice. It does have a 50-50 sink. Y'all know, if y'all been watching my channel, you know my views on that. If you can't put a skillet in it, it's kind of pointless. But this is a model home. If you're getting one built, you can choose the sink you want. All right, we have a flex room here. And they've got it configured as an office. Of course, you could do whatever you want to with it. Make an office, a little media room, plenty of space to put, like a couch over there, a big screen TV, and have the capability of closing these doors so you're not disturbing the rest of the house while you're watching the game. What a very nice living space area here. Let's go see what's back in these rooms. Nice little niche. All right, Bel Air does use uh, their house as a design center. So don't freak out and go, what the heck's going on with these cabinets? They're kind of showing you the different colors that they can build a home in, which is kind of neat. 
and there are different granite selections and different countertops and all that good stuff. But anyways, this would be a bedroom that has a kind of Jack and Jill bathroom where you have a private sink, but then you'll share the full bathroom right there. So this is a just an okay sized bedroom. More of their little design features here. Oh, it's a pretty deep closet back here. It goes quite a ways. All right, I had to pause the video there because somebody came in. But this is a really good sized room here that shares the bathroom, of course. They're using it as their uh, design center. So this is what I was talking about. This room will have its own sink, but still share the uh, bathroom with the rest of the house. All right, let's go check out the owner suite. Before we go in there, let's check out the backyard. Now, like I mentioned before, Bel Air does garden homes along with family homes. I'm pretty sure this would be considered a family home because it does have a decent sized backyard, but I could be wrong, but I would consider this kind of a family home. The garden homes are gonna have little to no yards especially on the side yards uh but man this is a pretty nice covered patio over here but a garden home is geared to more for those folks who don't want to be messing around the yard at all so they do have two different segments here what a nice setup Good size master bedroom here. Love the tray ceilings. Oh, but check out this shower. It does have the inset shower, so no stepping over anything. And it's a large one. It does have the shelf with a little bench there. Two different vanities at completely different locations. So if your spouse is a messy person, you don't have to be working with it. I closed that toilet before when I was previewing the house. Somebody came in and opened it up on me. I swear I did preview it this time. All right, but a really good sized shower. I mean, now I'm stuck on the bathroom stuff. Good sized walk-in closet. And I do like the fact that they've got a lot of technology. It's gonna all center here, the little box that's open. That's where you put your modems, your routers, and all that good stuff. So everything's in one central location compared to having it all stuck on your office desk. And homes like this, you're gonna have your ethernet cables already off, pre-ran through the walls. Uh, there's a lot of advantages for having a brand new homes because they're considering technology now in the build process. All right, that's gonna wrap up the tour of this beautiful home built by Bel Air in the Greenfield subdivision, just outside of Green, Texas, in, well, New Braunfels, Texas. It's a little confusing. Green is just a little pocket town inside New Braunfels. So if this community interests you and if it looks like it fits your needs, feel free to reach out to me and, uh, Always like, subscribe, and uh, keep watching these videos. All right, talk to you soon. Take care now. Bye.